guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, on today's John's Extra is basically the behind the scenes. The other day I had this idea of what I'm exactly doing today was I would love to be able to get up in the morning, get out of there, sit down somewhere and get maybe a sunrise video. I'm used to getting up early hours in the morning, I'm going to get up, I'm going to get myself dressed, get myself all prepared, and then I'm going to get out there and do a sunrise video. I am absolutely loving this location, and I'm not going to give too much away of what I'm looking at in front of me, because, oh my god, it's absolutely awesome, because you have to watch Sky 22 for that. However, if you look just behind me, see all these lovely trees here? They're just like, wow. And I don't know if it's coming up on the camera, guys, but we've got these, like, I think they're flying like gnats. I hope you capture that, but um, yeah, there's like these little flying things flying around me right now. So I'm sat here with this awesome view in front of me, guys. I'm actually on uh, Redbrook Field uh, in Rugeley. If you look at this map now, this is the field where I'm uh, circling is where I am at now. When I got here, it was a lot more dark than it is now. And um, so I sat, I'm sat here in this, you know, with all my stuff around me here, right, and. Uh, all I can hear is like noises from like my, my, my from my left, from my right, and then I heard a noise not so long ago from behind me, guys, and I was like, what the hell is that? So I turn around, and I'm like thinking to myself, I'm thinking, well, what is that? And it got me questioning, like, how many species is in within this area? So I think I picked the right day this week to uh, do this. Um, I just, I feel so... I don't know, peaceful, relaxing, and the view that I'm seeing right now, guys, is really off-putting. I'm really trying to, you know, talk to you, but I can see something absolutely awesome just behind you, so to speak. <laughs> and uh, I can't wait for you to see it. It's going to be, as I said, Sky uh, 22, and that'll be on the channel. So it'd be great if you go and give that a bit of a look. But as I said, this location, I absolutely love it. But this is the, the thing that really, really frustrates me is that. See, Yvonne has got a perfect point when she says this, right? If they're able to carry that stuff to a location, surely they should be able to take it back. And if it's liquids and food and such, right, it's going to be a lot lighter to take back home with you. Do you really need to leave your crap here? I mean, like, let's have a look in this stuff, right? We've got cans. We've also got a cigarette packet. And that there, guys, is like got to be some age because we can't even have our cigarette packets like that now um, we've got some all sorts here some bottles there bottle there it's just and then this is what it looks to be like a, a, a sort of an old fire uh, um, fire pit somebody's made it's just utter disgusting and then an umbrella I mean like okay and then we got this well I don't even know what this is here I don't know, I shouldn't be really touching that. I think that was what the umbrella got put into. For a second, guys, I thought that said Tesco. But it doesn't. It says Westco. <laughs> oh, my God. But, yeah. I mean, like, come on. Do you really need to leave that amount of crap in a beautiful area such as this? Oh, my God. We have a plane just going there, guys. Right? And then if I zoom out here... We was also, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this, but there is literally three, four planes. Oh my God, there's four planes. I thought there was only three. One, two, three, and that one coming down, four. And what's even more amazing, I've just looked around next to my uh, left-hand side. There's also a plane up in there, but you can't, there's actually two planes. Cry, guys, it is absolutely amazing how many things you can see from this location. So last night, guys, um, I was looking at the old map. So if you look at this map now, where I'm circling there, as you can see it, it's got some numbers, right? And that means that's the height it is above sea level. So I've been looking across all of the Rougey area to see where the highest points are for the best views. So when I've done that, right, I've uh, also then went onto Google Maps, looked on there, and I put that little guy on the street looked around to see if there's a good view from that area if I could work with something there right and there's been a few areas in Rugeley that I've gone 
Oh my god, why have I not discovered that already? So yeah guys, um, I am so excited for you guys to watch the actual uh, sky video from this location because it's absolutely beautiful and the sight that I'm seeing now, I've been praying to everything to be able to get the chance to be able to capture that type of video but anyway guys unfortunately this is all i got for you for this little bit of a video i hope that you enjoyed looking around and uh, definitely seeing the things and hearing a little uh, bit of ambience in the background but i want to say a huge thank you for all of you for coming by it means the world to me and always do your best to stay positive and screw all those negatives and i'll see you guys on the next one all right bye easy bye <laughs>